So today's video is about peppermint. Um, I'm going to talk more about peppermint tea, but it can be used for a lot of different things. Um, it's not medical advice. You should always consult your doctor. Um, it can interact with other medications. And um, also, if you have like acid reflux problems or GERD, I don't think they really like you to use it. Um, so again, just talk to your doctor first. But peppermint, just like if you plant it, it just like grows like crazy. And um, it comes back every year. It's a perennial. And you can take the leaves. I would say probably like two cups of water um, to about 10 to 20 leaves. Maybe start out with 10 and see how it feels and everything. And then you can bump it up to whatever as you adjust to it. When I was little, um, we used it for nausea. Um, or just kind of like if you have a stomach ache. And I guess... There's kind of been some studies that it helps with um, IBS, but we used it for nausea, all kinds of different kind of nausea, and it always really helped me. Um, so my mom would boil um, 10 to 20 leaves in about two cups. Well, she would boil the water, put the tea leaves um, to the side. Once the water boiled, she would cut it off and, you know, let all the bubbles settle down and stuff. And then you just throw the leaves in the pot, let it steep, you know, 10, 15 minutes. And then you just take it out and you can strain the leaves out if you just want the liquid um, or you can leave them in there and just kind of drink around them. I always just took them out. You can add sugar or like honey or lemon or anything to suit your taste. And there are benefits of honey, which I am planning on making a video of, um, but you can um, serve it over ice if you want an iced tea um, or you can drink it warm, which is what I prefer and how we used it. But people also use it for like colds and coughs and congestion and all kinds of stuff like that. Um, but it's really, in my experience, really good for nausea. And that's what I saw most people kind of using it for. Um, you can also um, just take a leaf right off a plant and just chew it, you know, and it can help with that. And you can spit it out or whatever. Um, but, I mean, some people just chew it up and swallow it. And you can also use it, um, like, on your temples and stuff for a headache. Some people will just chew a leaf. And I've done this. If I have a headache, I'll just, like, chew a leaf or two. Kind of, like, leave it in my mouth, suck the juice out, and spit it out um, for a headache. Um, but I definitely use it for nausea. And it's awesome. I have a lot more mountain medicine videos that I'm going to be making. And I hope that this helps you.